It's January 15th, 2024, and the Mariner of the Day is second baseman Harold Reynolds, who was born on November 26th, 1960 in Eugene, Oregon. He was drafted by the Padres in the sixth round of the 79 MLB Amateur Draft and the Seattle Mariners in the first round, number two overall of the 1980 MLB June Draft secondary phase after not signing with the Padres. In his career, he played in Seattle from 1983 all the way up until 1992, where he ended up in Baltimore, and then he finished his career at the California Angels, uh, leading the league in stolen bases in 1987 with 60, but also leading in getting caught stealing with 20. But if you're going to lead the league in stolen bases, especially during that time, it's likely that you're going to end up with a uh, decent amount of caught stealings. Career wins above replacement of 15.8 through 4,782 at-bats, 1,233 hits, only 21 home runs, scored 64 runs, batted in another 353, 250 stolen bases, which is an amazing number, and had an OPS plus of 83. So advanced stats and the regular stats, not great for him, but it's okay. Um... And he played from 83 to 94, having a 12-year career. He's a two-time All-Star and three-time Gold Glove winner as a member of the Mariners, playing for Baltimore and California for a year each. He also has been named the recipient of the Roberto Clemente Award, and he is a four-time Emmy Award-winning television baseball analyst for the MLB Network and Fox Sports. So he may not have had the greatest um, career in terms of baseball, but he made a decent career. And he's been able to do a lot. Uh, he worked for ESPN for a little while. And he is the youngest of eight children. His brother, Don Reynolds, is a former outfielder who played parts of two seasons with the San Diego Padres. Kind of a cool guy. And it's always nice to see uh, baseball players who are not um, remembered often for their time with the Mariners because of nothing bad happening. That's one of the things. Like You don't get remembered for your time as a mariner. Harold Reynolds is an African-American man, and uh, that is important, as unfortunately Major League Baseball is still not as diverse as it would like to be. Part of that having to do with certain um, socioeconomic barriers that happen with baseball, and other parts of it having to do with just the fact that baseball is not um, the most popular sport in America anymore, so there's fewer baseball players born in the United States now, so actually there's a lot more foreign-born players, uh, players from the Dominican Republic, players from Japan. So d baseball is diverse, it's just interesting in terms of certain ways diversity is looked at in baseball. Uh, but it's really cool that Harold Reynolds had an amazing career, won a couple of, oh, four Emmys, 